Hey guys, I have been using i3 for a long time, but today I found three cool features, or rather three cool programs, which make i3 just a lot more fun to use. Now the first one's actually a fork of Pycom. It's a uh, by Joan Bird. Yeah. Anyways, and it supports really cool animations. So let me just showcase some of that. If I open up a bunch of windows and move them around. Look at these animations. Let me close some of them. Even the closing animations look cool, which is honestly awesome. Look at this. I don't. This is one of the main features I wanted when first learning i3 because I saw the Hyperland compositor and that had so many cool features, but unfortunately it was on WLAN, so I couldn't use it because I mean, we have NVIDIA drivers, so. Wayland just doesn't work. Um, the second really cool thing I want to show is auto tiling. Now, it sounds dumb because you know you can just manually open up windows like this and it's all fine. But this is not really good. And, and having to switch between vertical split and horizontal split is not too fun. So, what this thing does is let me just kill it. Auto tiling. So this is without, right? You can just see it opens up as normal. Now, if I start it, uh, now when I start it, it automatically sets up the workspace. So you can keep doing this forever, and it makes using i3 just a little bit more fun, in my opinion. So you should probably try this out. Now, the third thing is i3 swallow so suppose you're watching anime uh, you can just put swallow any cli or whatever you used to watch anime and then open it up and then choose whatever episode you want and now you'll notice the terminal is gone mpv is still there the terminal is gone though that's pretty cool. Now the terminal is automatically moved to your scratch pad, so it's still active, but you can't see it anymore. And this is honestly pretty good because there are some programs which you need the terminal for but don't want to see the terminal. So you know, just prep and swallow and the terminal will move out of your way. So yeah, those are the three things that make i3 a bit better.